everybody, Kaylee Garrett Zimmerman here, a physical therapist. I wanted to do a little bit of a different thing. Um, I have a question for you, and it's a serious question, so I want you to answer it honestly. How much time every single day do you spend on yourself, and what do you do with that time? I'm realizing now in my life uh, how important it is to self-reflect, spend time with yourself, do you, uh, figure out who you are, strengths, weaknesses, figure out all of those things and how important that really is. So initially, when I first started to do a lot of this personal development and I started to pay more attention to who I was and trying to figure out who I am, I began to um, spend maybe 20, 30 minutes on it maybe. Uh, but now, hey Buffy, now I spend upwards of one to two hours. Um, so I'm spending a lot more time on personal development. And let me tell you why. Changes in my life that were positive started to occur when I started to figure out who I was. When I started to spend time with myself, when I started to love who I was, doors started to open. When I figured out what my strengths and my weaknesses were, doors started to open. When I spent the time to really reflect on my days and to really reflect on my mistakes, doors kept opening. Um, whereas before, when I was only spending a little bit of time, my personal development used to be just reading and I wasn't reflecting and I wasn't really thinking about what I could improve. But now every conversation I have, whether it's on the phone, whether it's on the internet, I try to reflect on. I say try because it's almost impossible to um, do this with everything. But I try to reflect on it. I want to tell myself two things that I did positively to build the relationship or to help that other person. And then I tell myself two things that I can improve to get better at, to give myself something to continue to build on. I want to be better. I want to be the best person at being me. And I am the only person that can be me. So I'm trying really hard to make that change and to really spend all of that time on myself to figure out my strengths, my weaknesses, my conversations. How can I build my communication? How can I make it better? How can I improve somebody else's life based on how I'm speaking to them? Or how can I improve myself based on the situation? And this goes for negative ones as well. So don't think that it's only for the conversations that you have that make you feel good. If you feel bad, that's more of a reason for you to sit down and reflect on it. Um, and and <laughs> thanks, Jenna. Yeah, you need popcorn when I'm on here. I go on rants sometimes. Um, but yeah, you, you've got to really reflect on the negative things as well. So for instance, if you come across a conversation that you have or you come across an instance where you, let's say, gain, this happened to me this past weekend, somebody comments a negative thing on one of your posts. They say something to you in a message and it really doesn't make you sit well or settle well. Initially, our instinct is to just be like, oh shoot, they don't like me, whatever, I'm just gonna get over it and I'm gonna move on. Yes, you need to move on. However, reflect on that situation, try to figure out what offended that person. You don't even have to talk to them, but try to figure out what it was that you did that you can improve on. And it doesn't mean you need to go talk to them. It doesn't mean that you need to cause a situation, cause a scene, anything like that. You just need to kind of figure out how can you make yourself better? What did you learn? And I've said this over and over and over again, you know, spend time on yourself. And I, I will continue to repeat it because it's something I feel strongly about. You have got to spend time on yourself before you spend time with anyone else. Um, hopefully, you answer that in the comment session, uh, section. Remember, answer to me. Tell me how much time you spend a day on yourself and what are you doing? I'm curious to know what others do. I just kind of reported to you what I do in that hour to two hours a day and um, it has changed my life black to white. So it's really, really cool. Uh, hopefully everybody has a great rest of your day. Love you all and enjoy.